Alright, hey there guys. Uh, sorry we cut things off in the last episode, but uh, we're back here with Nightmare Troubadour. And we're gonna finish up this duel versus my and see what happens. Let's see. Okay, so she just ended her turn. Uh, she played a DD Assailant to end the last episode. Um, hmm. We could get some really good damage on her here. Or I could play Spirit Reaper and rip a card out of her hand. That honestly sounds better to me, so. Shinigami. Attack mode. Alright, and we'll go with uh, Lajin to attack DD Assailants. Alright, we still have Dust Tornado for her, uh, uh, she's got Harpy's hunting ground on the field. Okay, okay. Alright, oh, let me move my mouse out of the way there. There we go. That looks a little better. Alright, Spirit Reaper, attack her directly. <laughs> Let's see what card we get out of your hand, my dear. Okay, I'm guessing she bricked all monsters, too, because she hasn't been playing a lot of spells and traps this duel. What was it? What was it? Uh, oh, it was a spell. Ah, Cyber Shield. Okay. Uh, that makes sense as well, because uh, we've been doing good keeping her off of the, uh, the Harpy Ladies as well, so that makes a lot of sense. That makes a lot of sense. So, alrighty, I uh, end my turn. Go ahead, my what you get. Nothing? Oh, GG. <laughs> <laughs> so we've got x -Ed Cannon here. Oh, let's BM a little bit. Pot of Greed. And this lets me draw two cards. Uh, okay, nothing too good. I was going to really say. <laughs> Alright, well, I'm not going to risk like discarding anything from her hand and, you know, somehow helping her out. So we'll just attack with the uh, x -Ed Cannon. Double Cannon Barrel Blast. <laughs> We'll go with Lashin. Okay, and I don't want the timer to run out this time. So what time is it? 3:34. Okay, we'll go to uh, four just to, just to be safe. So also, I think I got uh, I think I got a new uh, Let's Play premiering here at four. Uh, yeah, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh! Reshef of Destruction or Rashef or Reshef, however you say it. Uh, yeah, so feel free to check that out if you guys are kind of into that kind of game. Ah, oh, I lost. The worst nightmare I could ch imagine just came true. Say it ain't so, my. Say it ain't so. Uh, alright. Let's just do some more duels in the meantime. There's E. Joey, who registered us last episode. Uh, the mansion should still be locked at this point. So... Yeah, and if all you want is the Expert Cup, I mean, you could just, uh, oh my, again, you could just kind of, like, do the whole trick with the, uh, the shop, where you just basically head from your house to the shop to your house, so you could head, you know, between those two back and forth, just to waste time in the day, if you just want to get, you know, straight to the event, but, you know, normally we do all the duels we can, so we're just doing the normal thing, so. Alright, who goes first here, huh? Okay. Well, we got giant germs, so I'll conduct my first turn as usual. Then we'll go back to big screen. DD Assailant. Well, she just seems to get that one pretty often. Alright. Your turn, Mai. I've got swords, but I want her to attack, so. Yeah. The swords isn't very good in this matchup, mainly because of hunting ground. Whoa, that's a uh, big monster. Big beefy monster. Okay. Face down. So, well, she got her usual strategy this time. Wait, she didn't attack? What? <laughs> okay, well, that's a lot of back row, so. Heavy Storm, thank you very much. Solomon's Law Book. Shadow of Eyes, okay. Well, I'm glad I got rid of Shadow of Eyes, but nothing. Why didn't she attack? She powered up this monster, too. Like, that's what baffles me the most. Um. I will play Magician, should I play Magician of Faith to take back Heavy Storm, or should I play it to take back Graceful Charity? Uh, good question. You know what, let's, uh, let's play Graceful Charity, well, no, no, wait, I want the germs to go off, that's right. Hmm. I'll play Magician of Faith, we'll take back Heavy Storm, we'll take back Heavy Storm. 
Yeah, why didn't she attack, bro? What the... What are you doing, my? Yeah, replay your muscle up blood nuzzler. I don't care. She's still not attacking. Well, I guess this is good for us. Um, fine. Spirit Reaper, face down. Alright, my. Alright. Now, the her set monsters... I mean, we know she does play Magician of Faith. So I'm guessing at least one of those Magician of Faith, but... I don't know why she's not attacking with the Salem. I really don't know why. But, uh... We've got a board full of five monsters now, so whatever. Another face down. She's just asking for me to revive Heavy Storm. Okay. 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 Alright, let's do it, boys and girls. Let's make her pay. So, Magician of Faith, go. Uh, and we'll take back Heavy Storm. Storm activates. MST. Mirror wall. Glad to see that go. Okay, that's gonna stack to the top. But honestly, I'm not too afraid of her because she's not attacking us at all. Let's play Swords just to see what she's working with. Magician of Faith. Two Magician of Faith. Okay. I can understand you not attacking with those, but uh. Yeah. Oh, she targeted Pot of Greed twice. <laughs> uh, Alright. We'll switch... Uh, switch Germ to attack mode. Let's... Uh, summon... Dunamis Dark Witch. Let's... We can attack directly too, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Switch Spirit Reaper to attack mode. And let's switch same game to attack mode. Okay. Okay. Alright. We're all in. Uh, what's the defense of Magician of Faith? 400. Hmm. Alright. Germ in. Alright. Well, we'll just attack with everything here. Okay. You need to attack Assailant. There we go. Making sure I chose the right monster there. Alright, down you go. We'll both get banished. Yeah, for the light. I don't know why in the world she wasn't attacking this. But she was, like, powering it up, so... I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe they thought my was too hard and they just do that to give you a chance. I don't know. But, uh... Same game? Attack that Magician of Faith with your claws. Let's see if we can get rid of that pot of greed. <laughs> it's funny how the AI targeted it twice. But at least we did use swords there, because that way we stopped her from using pot of greed like uh, three times. Because that's no bueno. That's, you know, that's Haxor. I mean, uh, getting it back once, that's fine. Okay, we discarded um, uh, Harpy Lady Sisters. Yeah, hurting and get getting it back once, that's, you know. But if we would attack them one by one, that's... Yeah, that would have sucked. Uh-oh. Did she finally get her Harpy Lady? Maybe she's had it the whole time and she was baiting us. Well, maybe she'll draw it, yeah. Mm, nope. Good. Good, good. Next head cannon. Very good. Solid monster. Let's summon it. I don't know. Maybe I should switch Magician of Faith. I will put just her in defense mode. You know, just in case there's some kind of mirror force or something. I mean, I doubt there is, but, uh... Eh, you never know. I mean... You don't want her to get a 5 for 1. That would just be brutal. <laughs> Alright, let's see what we discarded here. So with Spirit Reaper, we got... Uh... Oh! Harpy Spent Dragon out of her hand. Okay. Sweet. Alright, say goodbye to that. <laughs> Alrighty, my. Giant germ. Okay, 342. We're doing good on time. Uh huh. 
Sand Gear, Scratch, Claw, Slash. I love the night theme that plays here. It's so good. Alright, what you got, Mai? No monsters. That's what I like to see. Uh, I don't think we can get exact zero. She's got 2200. Mm, or if we can draw you're a little late to the party. Uh, yeah, I don't think so. We'll just attack. We'll just attack. Uh, Spirit Reaper, you're first. Okay. Doesn't look like she has mirror wall or anything, so... Alright, let's get rid of the last card in her hand. And we should see the bonus here, too, so let me just... Oh, right, right, we knew she... Yeah, because we destroyed Malevolent Nuzzler so many times, we kind of, uh... uh that helped her break, honestly. Because uh, she revived it twice, so... <laughs> that kind of helped us, honestly. But she re really bricked hard as far as getting uh, monsters. Normally she gets out of at least one Harpy Lady, you know what I mean? But, uh, yeah, we didn't even see Flying Kamakuri, so pretty lucky. We got lucky that she drew bad, so. Alright. Yeah, we know. Worst nightmare. Okay. Oh, still nothing happening, huh? Okay. Well, fine. Well, I guess we'll do one more duel. Uh, I guess this time we'll duel Joey, if it's still just her and mine. I mean, we haven't registered my, so maybe I should duel her, you know, now, while I can, uh, while I know it's her right here. Uh, maybe there's someone, I'm surprised Kaiba or Yami Yugi aren't, aren't, uh, whoa, what happened there? Aren't here on the map. Oh, maybe it's implied, though, at this point that they're in the mansion. Ah, uh, that kind of does make sense, honestly. Well, you know what? This is going to be the My Valentine dueling episode. I mean, I know this is her, so... And we haven't registered her yet, so maybe... Yeah, you or me. Let's find out who's stronger, hon. Yeah, maybe... She'll register us. Eh, if not, you know. It helps. Yeah. Or maybe I'm just scared of Joey, guys. Maybe, you know. Maybe I fear his Brooklyn Rage. Joey is pretty strong in this game. Okay. And I know she has hunting ground, but you know what? We're gonna set three. And pass. I probably shouldn't be doing that, but... I really want to use Robin Goblin. Darn it. She got it first turn. Okay. Well, you're gonna have to take a blind shot, my. I'm assuming she's got Harpy Lady this time. Mmm, yeah. Hmm. No, thank God. Okay. Okay, we can kind of even the score here. Uh, let's play Robin Gup. Uh huh. Okay, ooh. Okay. I play Grave Robber. This lets me steal a card from the graveyard. I choose Pot of Green. <laughs> and actually, we know she's on Magician of Faith a lot. Let's see if we made the ultimate play. Flip up that card, my. Oh, it's just Kamakuri. Okay, okay. And what's funny is I actually don't want Kamakuri to get its effect here. So I might just play Cyber Jar and call it a day. Well, we got this Tornado. We got this Tornado. All right, my dear. I'll set a card face down, and I actually won't attack you this turn. Yeah. Go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I pass this turn. I thought we got her in the, like, she set Magician of Faith again, but no. Alright. Uh-huh. At least we're drawing Dust Tornado consistently in this deck, though. It's pretty good. Um... Okay, yeah, let's set this... Let's play Dust Tornado on the hunting ground. Uh-huh. Bye-bye. I mean, we might help her redraw it, but... As long as it's gone for this turn, I'm happy. Let's flip Morphing Jar. Alright, new hand. Let's see what she discarded. 
Ooh, like some good stuff there. Let's check that out. Uh, wow, yeah. Yeah, Birdface, uh, DD Warrior Lady. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, this has got 900 defense, right? Hmm. Okay. We'll go with Giant Germ. Hmm, I could actually give her a monster here. Creature Squad? Sure. I'll give you my morphing jar. What away? Wait, 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 what am I thinking? If I give her giant germ, then I can, uh, yeah, I can float. Oh, thanks. It's a pretty decent monster. Okay. So, yeah, let's, uh, excite cannon, attack this. Nope. Ah, she didn't play mirror wall either. Good, 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 good. Okay, yeah, and then I get two giant germs. Nice, this is a good combo for us this turn. Robin Goblin will take out a card. Mm hmm. Good card, good hit. Okay, and then, yeah, Giant Germ floats for us. So we'll get two more. Nice, 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 nice. Alright. Very good, very good. Okay, Giant Germ will attack her Kamakuri while we know hunting grounds off the field. Uh-huh. So she should float into a harpy. Can I defeat it, though, in the middle of the battle phase? Let's see. Harpy Lady 2. Okay, that's the one that affects flips. So, let's play... Oh, yeah, I have Shrink. Oh, yeah. All right, let's play Shrink. I'm just trying to get as many cards out of her hand as possible here. After the Morphing Jar. So she's down to 650. Oh, that's perfect. Morphing Jar, get in there. Destroy that Harpy Lady. Oh, yeah. Morphing Jar, too strong. Yeah, let's get another card out. Robin Goblin. Ooh, yeah, get rid of that. Triangle uh, Ecstasy Spark. All right, Giant Germ. Direct Attack. Nice. This was a very good turn. Okay. Okay. Very good. Oh, and we got rid of Harpy Lady 3. Good, good, good. All right, and uh, I guess I'll end my turn, Mike. Thanks for your Amazon Archer. I might use its effect to win. <laughs> Bird face, yeah. That's, you know, another face down. We do have to watch out for uh, Mirror Wall here. La Jin, good, good. Um... Let's see. Well, actually, we don't have to worry about Mirror Wall. What's this? Call of the Haunted. Wow. Yeah, maybe I could just use Amazon Archer. So, we've got four extra monsters. I could summon those Jin. Man, we could do a lot of massive damage with her. But no, no, no. I'll just play Smashing Ground here. Get rid of her bird face. Okay. Uh, maybe I'll do it main phase two. In case she has any traps here. Okay, let's attack. Uh, this should be the end of the duel. So let's play Morphing Jar first. Very good, very good. Discard your last card, my. <laughs> oh, another Kamakuri. Yep, you probably should have gone with that, honestly. Instead of your bird face. But uh, I'm not one to judge, but I kind of am. Okay. Devil Cannon Barrel Blast. Nice, and I think we can get one more duel in this episode, because we're only at 351, so... Or, then again, maybe some story stuff will happen, I don't know. Giant turn. And I guess we'll use Amazon Archer's Effect here a couple times to end the duel. Oh, no, wait, we only need it one time, huh? Nice, nice, yeah, because how much burn damage is it? Nice, 1200, okay. Alright. GG. Amazon Archer, go. Yep, we'll use her effects. She does, her art looks pretty good in this game, honestly. Uh, okay. Morphing Jar. And Giant Germ. Bye bye. Oh, we win. Alright. Hand Destruction Bonus, heck yeah. Pretty good. Kaiba core points, 115. All right. Oh, I lost. Yeah. Oh, here we go. Story time, guys. 
let's, oh wait, let's already return? Oh. Well, that's not what I expected to happen. I thought something from the story was happening. Wait, maybe we have to wait until the next day? For the, uh, the thing at the mansion? That's strange. Or maybe something will happen when we try to go to sleep here. I don't know. Sleep? Yeah. Uh, it's morning. Oh! Well, that's not what I expected to happen. Apparently, that was a normal night. Okay. Let's go here. Uh, since this is a new day, let's change to Exodia Deck. And there's a look at the whole deck if you want. Do, 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 do. Okay. Also, I think I have uh, like three Magician of Faith in this deck. No, just two. Okay. okay. I was getting ready to say, huh, we have 27, 27 Kyber Core points. That's epic. Well, I guess we'll try. Hmm. That's the thing, though. Do I have enough time for an Exodia duel? Hmm. You know, these early opponent people aren't too hard, so we'll try. We'll try. You know what? We'll try versus Mokova. Ultimately, I need to test this deck anyway, so... I gotta get stronger. Yeah, Flood, it's time to duel. I gotta help my big bro. Yeah, if we can't beat uh, Mokova with this Exodia deck, I definitely need to make some changes in it, so... Honestly, this will be a good test. I'm not saying we gotta beat him fast or anything, but, like... As long as I can control the field and stuff, that's the main thing I'm looking at. This is a pretty, 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 pretty good hand. I'd agree. Uh-huh. Alright, we'll go with Zarion in attack mode. And we're not going to set anything. I will, though, play Feather of the Phoenix. Let's discard Wobbukin to a stack pot of greed. Man, that is, that is broken. Okay, go ahead, Mokuba. That's a pretty good start for you, too. Graceful charity. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, well, I can use my piercing effect on those, though, so not to worry about your shoot tokens, buddy. Storm? <laughs> We've seen Heavy Storm a lot this episode. Taunts. Fiend Comedian. Yeah, get rid of those. Don't want you banishing my Pot of Greed. What if I get my Magician of Faith? Pot of Greed. Let's me draw two. Uh, good, good, good. Very good. Um, yeah, let's just, uh, set Time Machine. Let's activate Card of Safe Return. And, uh, yeah, I'll just use the, uh, piercing effects for, uh, Exarion Universe here on the sheep token. Uh, let me make sure I'm doing this right. Yes. There we go. Alright. So all I have to do is kind of click through A there. Okay. Good enough. Ooh, 1400, Mokuba. <laughs> okay. Your turn, buddy. Forest. Well, that uh, doesn't really change the equation here. I'm a beast warrior type, after all. Okay. Ooh hoo, hoo hoo. We drew another one. All right. I don't know what I was doing. I guess I'll set Mirror Forest. Was I afraid of Mokuba's heavy storm? <laughs> uh, let's attack this one. Uh, yes. I'll use the effects. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, the big question is, is, should I use it on the first monster he played this one? Um, well, hmm, uh, yeah, sure, why not? 
Griffor. I think we lost as far as the stats there. Yeah, yeah. By 100. Okay. It's all good. But now we know not to use the effect next turn. There's the koala. Yeah. Okay. Ah, good thing I set Mirror Force, huh? Koala. Uh, yeah, let's play a card. I've got a little special card right here. I like to call it Mirror Force. Now your koala's attack is reflected back on itself. Alright. Revival Slime, huh? Sure, why not? Is that just game? Uh, it might be. Attack. If not, nothing else, you know, uh, Jam and uh, Card of Safe Return is still a good combo, so. Is this gonna do 2000? Oh, oh, I guess that is game. Ah, uh, sweet. Alright. Well, might as well show you guys the points. There we go. Okie dokie. Thanks, Mokoba. <laughs> Man, we drew a lot better than the first time I tested with this deck, that's for sure. But, uh, yeah. Hot Agreed Feather to the Phoenix? Yeah, it's a pretty good starting hand, though. Yeah. Hey, I'm looking for Blue Eyes White Dragon. So I can be like my big bro. If you haven't, I'm willing to pop part with Karkadaz. I think he offered us this trade last time. I'm pretty sure I said no, though. Huh, I didn't want that card anyway. Oh, don't lie, Mocha, but you want to be like your big bro. No, no, but, like, I have to decline that trade. Sorry, bro. Because I'm pretty sure I'm still sitting on only, uh... I'm sitting on, like, only two blue eyes, so... Yeah. Like, I had... If I had, like, five or six blue eyes, I would do it just because, you know, I don't know. It would make Mokuba like us more, but, uh... Because normally I'll do most trades in this game, but... I mean, at some point, I do want to show off Ultimate Dragon, so... Can't really afford to do that trade with you right now, buddy. So, all right, but uh, that's gonna do it for this one episode. So uh, yeah, uh, thanks for joining me, guys, and I will see you all next time. Bye bye.